quickly and then come and watch this video sequentially. Now today's topic is seed germination. The plant reproduces by seed. When the plant is reproducing by seed, this is known as seed germination. Now plants are so amazing. Do you know children? They can reproduce not only from seeds but also from leaves, from stems, from roots and also from the spores. So they are so amazing in nature. Now what is the process of seed germination? Have you ever seen the kidney bean seeds or have you ever learned about the different parts of the seed? If you have not learned about the different parts of the seed and if you don't know what are the different parts of the seed, then please do go and check my video which is in the description and there I have already taught you about the kidney bean seed. Okay? Now in this part, a seed first comes which is kept in the moist soil. Now gradually the seed and the, or the embryo, the baby plant or the parts of the seed which I have taught you in the previous video that is the cotyledon store food for the baby plant or the embryo. Now the baby plant or the embryo absorbs water, absorbs nutrient from the soil and also it takes energy from breaking down the food, stored food that is already present in the cotyledons. Now the baby plant gradually sprouts out and gradually the shoot comes and it grows towards the sun. As you can see in this picture, the shoot is growing towards the sun. Okay. Now here you can see it is getting the sunlight, the seed is getting the sunlight and all. And now the shoot is coming out and the root is also coming out from the seed. And the root is fixing the plant to the ground. Now... The plant gradually grows up, it bears branches, it bears leaves, it bears all the fruits and flowers. And now it has become a big plant. Okay, so this is the process of seed germination in short. And you are watching this video on Anamika's Edu Space. So, in this part, we will study about seed germination in details. Now, what do you mean by germination of seed? Germination is the process by which a baby plant or a seedling grows from a seed in the presence of three important things. So the question when it comes that what are the three important things that are needed for seed germination? First is water, then is air and then is warmth. Okay. So the three important things needed for seed germination is air, water and warmth. Air from the soil that is air trapped in the soil, water from the soil only, water and nutrients and also the minerals and the warmth from warmth or heat from the sunlight. Okay, so what is the process of germination? Germination is a process by which baby plant or seedling grows from a seed. As you can see in this picture, you can refer, here is a seed. Now gradually, step by step, the baby plant is growing from seed and it is producing our shoot, it is producing root and gradually it is growing up. This process we will study in details. Steps of seed germination. Let's see what is the first step. The first step is in the early stage when a seed is placed in the moist soil as I shown you in the picture. Do you remember? It absorbs water present around it. So in the early stage that is in the first stage of seed germination when a small seed is placed in the ground or placed in the moist soil. What do you mean by moist? Moist means wet soil. Okay. It absorbs water present around it. Now what does the seed do? The seed absorbs the water which is present in the soil. When we give or we water the plants, the seed absorbs that water which is present in the soil. I hope you have understood. Now moving to the next part of the next stage of seed germination. Now the next stage is the water then reach the baby plant or embryo inside the seed. Okay. Now once the seed is getting the water, it is absorbing the water. Now water gets inside from the seed core. Let's see a picture. 
So this is the picture. This is the first seed when the seed is placed in the moist soil. You can prefer the first point or the first seed with the first point. Okay. Now the second seed with the second point that is the seed or the water reach the baby plant or the embryo inside the seed. Now refer the third seed with the third point. Now what is the third point? The third point says the embryo absorb water and grows in size. Here you can see the seed as my pointer goes along. But in the second stage the seed is gradually developing and is gradually growing in size. And now in the third stage we can find the seed has already grown a little bit. See the shoot is coming up. Okay, here we will see the fourth stage. Okay, so in this stage, finally the embryo breaks open, that is, the embryo breaks. Okay, and what comes out from the embryo? The shoot comes out from the embryo, that is, the upper part of the plant or the stem of the plant. Okay, now as you can see, my pointer through the picture, you can see the upper part of the plant that is shoot comes out from the embryo and also the root okay so the baby plant forms the shoot that goes towards the sun and it also forms the root that goes towards the ground or soil now coming to the next point the baby plant in the or the embryo starts to grow its roots into the soil which in turn, here it is written turn. Okay, please do mark it. Which in turn fixes the plant. Okay, now coming to the next point. So, the next point says that the root helps to absorb water and nutrient from the soil. So, what does the root do? The root fixes the baby plant into the soil and it also helps in absorbing water absorbing nutrient from the soil now i hope it is clear to you all now coming to the next point then the shoot comes out of the seed and starts to grow towards the sun you can see here the shoot is growing towards the sky it is going above the soil and it is going towards the sun okay it is facing the sun in the sky and the root is growing downward 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 and it is fixing in the soil now coming to the next point of this video so the first period of leaves here we can see the green two green first period of leaves comes out okay so these are known as foliage leaves coming to the last part so this is called the young plant as you can see in this picture you can refer there are so many young plants in this picture which has just now sprout out from the seed and it is also called as seedling or sapling okay it is called as seedling or sapling i hope it is clear to you all now the whole process that is from point one to point eight the whole process is known as seed germination i hope it is clear that what is seed germination seed germination is nothing but the production of the baby plant or coming out of the baby plant from the small seed okay i hope it is clear to you all so children this was the end of the video now if you like the video and if you find this video helpful and if you understood this video then please do like share and subscribe to my channel to support my work so that i can bring more videos for you like this thanks for watching Bye bye